We're getting more details about that medley, a deadly Metro North commuter train derailment in the Bronx. Jennifer Mullen is in the studio this morning, and she has the update for us right now. Jennifer? Ed, the National Transportation Safety Board is investigating the incident that led to four deaths and dozens of injuries. Information from the train's data recorder shows the train took a sharp curve at 82 miles per hour, almost three times the speed limit. The engineer, William Rockefeller, is actually from Germantown in Columbia County. He says he applied the brakes, but the train did not slow down. An NTSB member says he's unaware of any problems with the brakes. The National Transportation Safety Board is working with Governor Cuomo and local officials to determine what exactly happened and why. They're expected to remain on site for the next week or so. We want to find out what the specific cause of the accident was uh, to see if there's anything we can learn from it to make sure a tragedy like this doesn't happen again. Rail experts say the tragedy might have been prevented if Metro North Railroad had installed automated crash avoidance technology that safety authorities have actually been urging for decades. Live in the studio, Jennifer Mullen, CBS 6 News.